Turn the wheel up bad to the wheel. Good morning, everyone. It's Kaiba on the Renegade. I'm back here with more Dark Souls 3, the Convergence mod, and today we are going to do the parkour. Hiya! We missed. We are not going to do the parkour. We are failures. Hey. Don't try to your face. Oh, I got something there. I didn't see what it was. That was probably just a chaos upgrade item, if we're being honest. No one told you that was okay. So just go doing it. Is this bonfire here at least? Nope. There's no bonfire in this game. Of course. One little rat. Yikes, that almost hit me. Come on, toxic. Tick down. There's another one here. No wonder this area is like locked up. Right? I can't believe I can one shot these things. They're always such a pain in the ass. So cool how that like lights up this whole area and everything. So yeah, no bonfire here either. That's a shame. I mean, it's not really. We're fine. I just I wanted one. Now we gotta go kill this. You're not the guy. You are also. Not the guy. Where's the guy? This would have been so cool. Did I reset my timer? I did. Good. And this area looks so sick. Like, I really like the way they remade this. Who that? He looks special. Alright, no ambush. Was so fast. He didn't stand a chance, guys. I'm shocked that this weapon is so strong. Ugh, excuse me. I mean, like I said, it it kind of seems like this weapon is meant to be the ultimate weapon for this build, but uh, is very strong. Very strong. 
Like, if there were weapons like this in Elden Ring, then holy fuck. If this is what the ultimate weapons were like, then we would be fucking two-shotting people. Because, like, now, in Dark Souls 3 at the very least, um, like, most builds do have ultimate weapons, quote-unquote, but, like, most of them aren't so much better than all the others that, like, the others are also worth using. Like, um, for a dark build, the Onyx Blade is kind of the ultimate weapon, right? So it's more or less the one you would want to use over pretty much any other, but it's not entirely that way. There. Hi. Yikes. He just didn't stand a chance. Um, but yeah, like, so for dark builds, right? If you're using regular weapons, as well as, um, uh, the actual dark stuff, then your ultimate weapon is almost certainly going to be the Onyx Blade, right? Because it's just one of the best. But you could also have a pretty decent variety of weapons, even though it's still not anywhere near as good as the Onyx Blade, right? So, like, um, a dark sword infused with dark is really good. Or, um, I don't know. Uh, I've just, I've looked around a few different things. Oh, I forgot these guys keep getting up. <coughs> uh, but yeah, there are certain things that are pretty strong. And, Capricorn. No, I guess that's actually fair. This room is full of Capra Demon corpses. I wonder if they're gonna bring back Butt Demon, or it's Horse Demon. Capra Demon, stop walking away. He didn't hit for shit, dude. Yeah. I'm dead keeping you up by talking, huh? I'm sorry. It's for the videos. Dude, I just got the Capra Demon Skull? Okay, no weapon is buffed, but still, jeez. That was a regular R1, and we nearly one-shot it. If this weapon were upgraded all the way, we would have one-shot it. That's just nuts. Is that the bonfire right there? It kind of looks like it. Like, man, I'm just shocked. I'm shocked at how freaking strong this weapon is. <coughs> and I'm not gonna lie, its moveset is even growing on me. I think that said it was like someone's tainted twin daggers or something. This is the bonfire, heck yeah. Pray to the altar of chaos. Demonic dual swords. And the chaos bow. Smoldering set. Reduces FP consumption of conjuration by 10% and increases fire damage. That's not bad. Chaos Servant Blindfold. It's 2% fire damage and an additional FP region plus 5% max FP. Ooh. Interesting. Interesting. Unfortunately, my set's still better than that, but... Isolate Disciples. Chaos Remnant. How bad is it? Normal? Yeah, unfortunately we're not going to be able to run to- well, maybe we could. I'm not going to try, though. I mean, we are right next to a bonfire, but eh. 
I just don't really want to risk it. Not gonna risk it for the biscuit. Ah, oh, there were two rats. At least we killed them both in one go. Giant rat? Yeah. Oh, he took some damage. Alright. Too strong, I'm telling ya. Oh, this is just open. I actually kind of expected that to be a mimic for a second. Like, the second I just clicked to open, I was like, fuck. <laughs> because if the wall's already open, then. Maybe it's the lighting. Yeah, maybe it's the lighting. We're one-shotting these guys as long as our weapon's buffed. No, that was so fast. That's okay. I guess we deserve to die at least sometimes. That was like two seconds in the cursed fog. So if we buff our weapon, I feel like we're probably going to be pretty good here. Oh, it even disappears faster. That's very good. Yeah, so they made it stronger, but it disappears faster. Honestly, that's fine. I don't mind that. I actually welcome that change. Oh, my buff wore off. Cool. Cool. I really like this weapon, guys. It's fun. Oh, even my running attack had that. Oh, get out of the... Jeez. Bye. Oh, sorry. Sorry, my man. That's not sorry. That's crab. Who told you you were sorry? You need to stop. Go back to living in lava land. Open a fight, sorry. Or at least, like, another NPC. Maybe he's up on the bridge. Nope. Oh, look who called that one. Yikes! What was that? Oh, you're another archer, okay. 
Well, let's hope we can do it. We can. Also, it doesn't appear to have any effects immediately. Ow! Yeah, it's just damage. Okay, bye. We were surrounded. Okay, well, let's find the ladder, I guess. We've already been up here, but it's not really that big a deal. Yeah, there's no one. Oh, wait, yes, there is. It's down. We actually just came from it. I forgot all about it. Never mind. Yeah, the one bonfire here in the demon ruins is freaking in the middle of it. That's actually kind of funny, but also kind of makes sense if you think about it. Because, like, I don't know, it just, it, the bonfire being in the center makes it so that it's something you have to actually work to find. That was normal. And I kind of like that. It's nice that you have to show up here and then go look for it to be able to find it. More Skelemans. Well, that guy's dead. Is that guy seriously not dead? Holy shit. That looks really cool. Just a big old pile of burning demons. Alright, so it looks like we've deactivated all of those tower things, which is good. That's something I wanted to make sure we did. Hey, I killed you, sir. So we can get some distance with that. The Legionnaire set and the Molten Dagger. Ooh. Um, it would actually probably be easier to go through the other way, but we're gonna keep going this way just to try and force it, I guess. The Demon Scar! Hell yeah! We might not. Bone wheels! Bone wheels! Bone wheels! They're below a bad to the wheel. Oh! Hello! See ya! Sorig! What are you doing here, my guy? Jesus, you were not ready. Huh? I love how I can just tank his attack and fucking destroy him at the same time. Like, this really is Elden Ring before Elden Ring because poise works. <laughs> and it doesn't just work, it works really well.
Honestly, I think the HP we're seeing drop there are demons that the Black Knights are killing. Which is actually really cool. So yeah, we deactivated all the towers by killing all the guys. Which I think is probably going to be like some hidden mechanic in this boss fight that we're not even going to get to see because we're going to go up in there and wreck him. Alright, let's find out what we got. It's just the old Demon King. Alright. I'm down. <laughs> That's so strong. No bonfire? I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense that they haven't had bonfires at any of these places. Just because, like... I mean, I'm not totally sure why not. Because, like, it just does kind of make sense to have the bonfires here. But at the same time, like, there wouldn't be bonfires here, just period, because the bonfires are created by the undead, right? <clears throat> I mean, I could be wrong about that. I don't actually know enough about the lore to know where the bonfires come from or any of that. Um, but yeah, there goes the demon ruins. That was fun. I am very surprised that it was so simple. But, again, we have a stupidly overpowered weapon. Um, so, where else can we go? Oh wait, you know what? I wanted to see, just real quick, since we have it now. There. We don't have enough strength to wield it. But... Nope, it's regular. Hmm. I was kind of hoping it was going to be dark. Oh well. There. Yeah, let's, let's real quick just organize my weapons so I can find stuff when I'm looking for it because, like... It's just so frustrating to open my menu and try to switch, but then I can't. Dude, we could have gone there and gotten a chaos weapon and made fucking um what is it? The the darkness sister freed so easy for ourselves. Like we could have made it so easy, you don't even know. Actually, hang on. Do want that, and we'll keep that too. That's always fun. The yeah, Astoras is good, but honestly, it's better in PvP. So like, 
Capra's paired machetes. Cool. Holy for the strength. We can't wield that and we'll never be able to on this build. We can wield that, but honestly. Oh, I mean, it's got a cool weapon art. I'll hang on to it. Besides that, it doesn't deal dark damage, it deals magic damage, so. That's pretty good, frankly. Says quick step, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm not actually gonna use this, but it is for the build, so. such a pain to switch items when I want to. Or switch weapons, I mean. <coughs> um, so, we might be not 100% sure. Welcome. Very well, then take it. Yeah, we can. Where's your keys, lady? Hmm. Where's your keys at? Does she not sell the key to that? Hmm. Maybe she doesn't. Herring pendant. Lowers all your damage. That's what I need right there. Put that on. Put that on right now. Where's your health? Removes default passive FP regen. Jeez. Why would you play with those? I mean, I guess if you want the hardest experience possible. Ashen she doesn't have the key, man. Do we have the key? It doesn't look like we do. I guess we'll go check and see if that's just open or something. Because I want to get the Firekeeper's soul so that we can um, get the good ending. Wait, no. Oh, it is just open. That's right. here. Looks so cool. The timer. See, that's why I'm doing this, is because I knew that friggin' that was gonna go off very shortly. Oh, we must have already gotten it. Okay. Well, whoever that monster was, he threw himself off the ledge. Why? Because ledges are dangerous, kitties. They are dangerous, and you should not throw yourself off them. Sorry, friend. Patches! I don't see the thing. 
Oh, well, I'm just gonna have to trust my instincts, I guess. Oh, no, I'm dead. Well, there's something down there for me, but I don't know what. That's actually probably the Firekeeper's soul now that I'm thinking about it. Also, you know what I got that I could have used and didn't? <clears throat> I've got that um, fall control potion. So let's go try that again just real quick. Because something tells me with that we're going to be fine. Was Patches over by um, the cathedral? I don't think he was. I feel like we were all like, oh, where's my Patches? Wouldn't it be funny if he was just still standing here like, haha, now I can go procure my trinkets from his corpse. Procure my corpse trinkets. Okay, let's hope we don't die. Yes. Sweet. The Firekeeper's Mask. I wonder what that does. Uh, actually, let's go outside where I'll be able to see. Oh my god, I said be able to see, but apparently the lag says otherwise. What does this do? Increase power of bombs by 1%, item discovery by 25%, and Estus recovery by 50 Holy shit! Here we go. Increases damage against demons by 4%. Really? That's it? Does it look cool at least? It looks very cool. So the blindfold mask boosts attunement, and that one boosts vigor and luck. I kind of want to go for it, but at the same time, like, we don't actually have an outfit that really works for it. That looks like Carla's coat. Yeah. Yeah, nothing all that special. I think we'll stick with our Blood Guard set. I was hoping there was gonna be like a special armor set for us to find somewhere. But it's looking like there isn't gonna be. At least looking like. Of course we don't actually know, but... We won't find out until we continue. Alright guys, so thanks everybody for watching. I've been Kaiba on the Renegade. Uh, if you like this video, please leave a comment. Tell me... Hmm... I really thought 
thought about this while I was checking my armor set. Tell me what armor set you're wearing in the Convergence mod. So I'll see you guys next time. Hope you have a great day. Bye bye. Hi, I'm Jim the Hollow, and you should like and subscribe to increase your chances of catching a shiny by approximately 0%.